It's D King. I'm back like I never left. I'm cooking up content like a chef, shooting videos like I'm Steph uh, Curry. So here I'm subscribe, cause it's time for us to slide. Time for us to slide, baby. Huge shout out to everybody in the Triple C's. The Triple C stands for the Cars and Crib Crew. If you're a part of that, make sure you throw them C's up in the comment section. And if you would like to be a part of that, make sure you smash the subscribe button first, then hit the like button, and after that, throw them C's up in the comment section. In today's video, you're gonna find out the biggest mistake I've made with my cargo van business. My biggest mistake, baby. But first, we gotta go get some of this money like it ain't funny. We have an order on Rody, Rody, Rody with a Dabber Ranch. We got an order on Rody. We are picking up two items that weighs 138 pounds each. We're gonna drive five miles for 4611. Don't forget to thank God for your blessings. I'm about to get this money when you're stressing. Let's go. Just like that, we are here at Home Depot. We're trying to stack these chips like Pringles. Dang. We got big people over in this joint, baby. Yeah. I waited in line. You pick it up? Yes, sir. I have a Rody order to pick up. Rody order. Are you Spark or Rody? Rody. 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 Rowdy. Bro. <laughs> There's so many freaking people picking up. U.S. Pack, Rowdy, Spark. All right, what's the order number? H6981-1218-6. Two sets of shell. He has the driver on the back. That's why I'm going to let them know. Yeah, the yeah. You know how to go around the back? Yeah. Okay, just make your way over there. He's going to let them know. Okay. Him yeah, head by the back door. All right. Thank you. You guys have a good one. <clears throat> Just like that, we are in the back. Right at tat tat. Let's see if somebody gonna help us real quick, baby. Um, I don't know who I'm supposed to talk to. Do you do you work? Have a delivery? I have a pickup, yes. What's the name? Uh Vickers. They just told me to come back here right now. I just came from the front. It's, fine. it's pretty heavy though. You, you might not want to take it. No. Oh, that's it? Yeah. That's 138 pounds each. Oh, I got a dolly. I ain't, I ain't worried about it. I got a dolly. You're a better man than me. <laughs> You're a veteran, so you smart, huh? <laughs> Little slide. Slide? Oh, what's that? Yep, yeah, we got caught up. Okay. Thank you very right. much, sir. I appreciate your help. You too. And just like that, we got everything strapped up. Now it's time for us to go get these bucks. Let's go. I have a four wheel cart, I can roll it in or however you, you guys. You want him to wheel it in, Greg? You want him to wheel this in? Huh? We've got a hand cart. Hold okay. on. Where is it, Greg? It's no big deal, it's right here. I can just grab it. Yes. <laughs> it's gonna be a lot easier, right? Yeah. It'll make our life easy. <laughs> Why not? It's actually nice out today. Oh man. my god, I'm, I'll take off this coat off soon because I thought it was, the wind is blowing pretty bad, but other than that, it's pretty nice. Can you move the cart right there to on the side? I can just roll it. Put it right here. Where, right here? Oh, this way. Mm -hmm. Bring it back to me. Just that easy. Where would you like it at, sir? What do you guys do here? Heating and air. Oh, really? HVAC? Yeah. How long you been doing it? Uh, we've been in business since 1990. Really? I was born in 90, so. Oh, really? That was a great year, I guess. <laughs> right? <laughs> Thank you. 
Family owned? Yes. That's what I'm talking about, keeping it in the family. Absolutely. You want to lift that and I'll yeah. pull this out for you. Thank you very much. Let's take a picture. Set back comes the photo. Smack. Got the picture. We are good to go. So, unfortunately, that was the only order that we got today, baby. For $46.11. We did get some other orders that came in. For instance, I did have an order that was picking up from Florin Decor driving 12 miles. It was 1,100 pounds, though. I think it was like 14 boxes of something. 14 boxes of hardwood. That's what it was. 14 boxes of hardwood for like $40 and some change. But I did not take that order. Now, I'm here to talk about my biggest mistake that I made in the cargo van business. And this, this I had to do some little thinking about this because I, once I don't get any orders, I start thinking about different things, guys. I, I definitely do. I'm thinking like, what am I doing wrong? What do I need to switch? What do I need to change up? um like i just i'm always thinking about the adjustments that i need to make now my biggest mistake of all in this cargo van business is i did make adjustments but i did not make adjustments soon enough so i i think that i feel like that i need to do more research on the market and everything while i'm out here like do more research on stuff because there may be an order that's paying fifty dollars for instance that order for forty dollars from uh flooring decor I'm thinking like I need like 65, 70 to do that order to take out them 14 boxes. But the market is very low right now. It's very slow in everybody area. So I should have just took that and then kept on moving and grooving. But a lot of times I get stuck in my ways and I get stubborn. And I want you guys to learn from me, baby, because I make mistakes all the time. I'm a human just like everybody else. I make mistakes all the time. And I probably should have took the order. But I'm thinking like the, my whole theory behind this is why I don't take those lower pan orders. It wasn't a terrible order, but it wasn't the best order either. So I kind of be feeling like that I need to start doing my research because this is the reason why. So right now the market is very low. The very everything is very slow everywhere. So the lower paying orders, more people are going to take the lower paying orders. My whole theory behind it is if I start taking lower paying orders now, where am I, where am I going to end up later on? Because what if the market shifts again? If the market shifts again, and I don't know, I'm still taking lower pet orders for $40 when I should be getting paid $65, $70 for the order, and I'm still stuck in that stuck in that, that mindset of taking the lower orders. So that's the reason why I get kind of stubborn. I don't want to take the lower paying orders, which I sometimes I should just take some, baby. Sometimes I take, should take the good with the bad. I do do that sometimes, but then sometimes I get stuck in my ways. Now, as far as the carrier company that we've been using, I literally only won one load last week one only one for the whole week one load for two hundred dollars that's the only one I, I won um, i put in a lot of bids and i did not win any of them i don't know what's going on maybe my prices are too high again the market has shifted and is everything is not booming like it was before so that could be a, a major issue on why i'm not making as much money as i could be making but i also consider gas prices and all that stuff and wearing on the van and everything i don't want to be driving i'm trying to get as close to two miles a close to two dollars per mile as possible um especially while we're doing them lows because i if i got to drive however many unless it's like close by if it's close by then the lowest i have went is for a hundred dollars before and i still didn't win some of those bids so i mean it just it just is what it is right now baby this is what's going on in the market i do need to start doing a lot more research on things so i can kind of get the gist of everything that's going on at the current moment because I'm just going off what I'm thinking. Like, man, I ain't taking that for that. I'm taking this, this. I'm gonna get this. So, and I'm thinking about last week. Last week I got this, but it ain't last week. It's this week right now. So, I want you guys to take that in consideration while you guys are out there and definitely learn from my mistakes. I'm trying to be great and don't hate. I know that some people gonna say, yeah, me, 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 yeah. I already know, baby. Everybody who be talking crazy in the comment section, y'all be talking real slick in that comment section. I want to see how you live and I want to see what kind of van you got. I want to see if you're doing this. If you're doing all this stuff, I, show me, hey, make you a channel. I, a lot of times, a lot of people try to go out there and critique everybody else, but they try to critique all the YouTubers and all this. Y'all messed up the market. Y'all saturated this and this and that. And that. I, I get it, man. Let's see how you live. Let's see how what's going on in your area, baby. Let's see how your fan is and all that stuff. And then we can have these discussions because I'm not even going to comment back to you if you're just out there hating and all that stuff. I ain't even going to write back to you. I'm going to let you be because a lot of times people try to push their insecurities on you. Don't let them, hey, don't let them gas you up. Don't let them put you in a box. They try to put you in a box. Don't let them put you in a box. So make sure you guys remember that. But all in all, I do need to be greater. I do need to stop being stubborn. I need to take the orders. It's I, I ain't gonna lie, man. I'm just gonna tell you the truth, man. Look, 
it'd be ugly, man. I'm like, I'm not about to go get the, go all the way over here, get this stuff for this little money. I just, I just don't feel like I should do it, but maybe I should. Now I only got one order today, and instead of me taking a little one that was a little bit less than I wanted to take, well, almost double what I wanted it to be, um, I ended up with nothing. So that's the chance you take when you're doing these gig apps and all this other stuff. You don't want, you want to put the bid in, or you want to try to get the order, and then you end up with nothing like I did today. And I only made $46.11. But I could have just put a little bit more hard work in, went and take that order. I mean, I would have came, I would have been like at $75, $80 then. But I don't know, man. I need you guys to comment below and let me know. What are you thinking about this type of stuff? I, I want to start implementing these this type of uh, talks and stuff in the videos. Comment below and let me know if you're liking it, if you're not liking it, if you just want to see me do gig apps, if you want me to go back in the car, you want me to do some DoorDash, Uber Eats. Like, what do y'all want, baby? Shout out to everybody who's really rocking with me. Like, when, when some, some negative stuff happens, everybody want to comment and tune in. But when there's something positive and good going on, nobody wants to tune in. So huge shout out to people who are really my supporters, who really supporting the channel and supporting the movie. Shout out to all of y'all. Shout out to everybody who gave me super chats. I really appreciate all the love and support from every last one of you guys. We're almost at 60,000 subscribers. By the time this video, it may be at 60,000. I don't know. But the goal is 100K at the end of the day. 100K by the end of the year, baby. So I need y'all to start sharing and smashing that like button and all that stuff. And hey, hopefully we hit that 100K by the end of the year. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, if you are not subscribed, make sure you smash the subscribe button. Also, give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to throw them C's up. And make sure you lock in tomorrow because it's going back down. We ain't playing around because 2023 is still big bag season. We'll keep on giving me a reason. I'll see you guys on the next one. Be going, be going, be flowing. You already know in the DDK. And I'm on my way. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You thought we was done? You thought we was done? You thought we was done? Nah. 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 Change your plans, baby. We actually did get us a load. We about to get our pockets on swole. Now, I put a uh bid in for this like hours ago, probably like three hours, three or four hours ago, and we finally got it, baby. So this one is 48 deadhead miles, 28 miles loaded. So 76 miles altogether for 200. About to pull up and show you who won it. Let's go. Just like that, we are here at the pickup location. For those who hate me, we gonna keep on skating. Let's see where we gotta go. I think we gotta go up here. Dang, ain't nobody in the show. I hear somebody, but I don't see nobody. Oh, hit the bell. Wait, don't put it on the scale. That bell, man. How you doing, boss? Um, I have a load to pick up to go to Sturdivant. Uh, open one, just six. Five, uh, four, five. Yeah, five, five, four, five, yep. Cool, cool, it's your copy. So if you're gonna come through this gate, mm -hmm. you're gonna go all the way to the back of the building, there's a ramp, mm -hmm. and they'll load your one skid. Okay, appreciate you, boss. Just like that, my guy about to get us right, we're about to get our pockets tight. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, it wasn't that bad. That wind is blowing so crazy today. I was trying to come in the highway, Blowing everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Right there is perfect. Yeah. Is that you all set on the paper? Yes, sir. Straight ahead here, your left. Go straight out. All right. Thank you very much. You have a great day, sir. Now after we suck it up and stop. <coughs> And just like that, it's game time. Y'all already know we about to get on the grind and shine. Let's go. We in this joint, baby. How you doing, boss? Yes, sir. I have a load to drop off for you guys. In the van. I'm in the van. And the van? Yes, sir. You're coming in skis? Just one. One, all right. Oh, yes, sir. Two meals, one meal for me, one for you. Yes, sir. Yeah. Ready, man. Thank you very much. You meet me over there? Yep. Yes, sir. Y'all see what's going on. How you doing? Thank you very much. You have a good one, boss. Yes, sir, we gone. And just like that, it is now officially the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the content. If you found this content useful in any way, make sure you smash the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up so we can continue to get to these bucks and grow and grow. And y'all already know, 
on the channel. We go out here to skull. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, if you're not subscribed, make sure you smash the subscribe button. Also, give me a thumbs up. And again, don't forget to throw them C's up and lock in tomorrow because it's going back down because we ain't playing around. The 2023 is still big bad season. We'll keep on giving a reason. I'll see you guys on the next one. We're going, we're going, we're flowing. You already know it. It's DDK, and I'm on my way.